Hello everyone, and welcome back to our tribal colony, the Forgotten Soldiers, where, yeah, we are not in the best of shape, unfortunately. We've got three of our four members in the hospital. Um, oh, I know, I know you're working. Kirkopods. Yeah, we have not been doing well pretty much this entire time. We've had issues, people aren't getting along, so even though we are, you know, trying to make progress, it's been a little rough, and, well, we, we don't like that. No, we don't. But, hopefully, it looks like Hawk is tending to people instead of killing them for once. Um, Hawk and Biko um, are not in good moods. Hawk could break again any moment. Alright, but at least we are getting, what was this gonna be? This was gonna be food stockpile, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. I am pretty sure that that is what it was going to be. Alright, and we do have, um, you know, some, some stuff going down around here. Alright, so this should be Hawk's room. We'll try and get, they won't haul that, but, because they've got way too many other things to do. Oh no! What's going on here? Oh yay, we're finally putting the roof over this place, that's good. I'm hoping it will be supported enough. Where is... Biko? Can you rescue this cassowary? Cause it just, it looks so sad. All right, you go sleep on the ground there, cassowary, please. So Hawk does have his own room now, which is nice. Oh, we can put a door in, how lovely. Scorpion and cassowary have formed a bond. Scorpion is named her Scarborough, but she isn't. Oh, I guess because we saved her or something. She is now ours, that's nice. Okay, wait. I didn't know Hawk and Val were in need of serious treatment. Okay, Hawk is good. I thought that they were okay. Um, prioritize treating him. Yeah, so we're, we're slowly working on our, uh, on our plans to have, you know, real bedrooms. But Hawk is still in a terrible mood, and eventually he's going to crack. But we do have a... Oh, okay, this is done. Great. Um, haul everything out, although they won't anytime soon. And we're going to put in a stockpile. And it's going to be for, not human-like, but yes, mechanical, but nothing rotten, and it's going to be for foods. Right? What's raw resources? Yeah, no. So there we go. They've already started using it. They put one simple meal in there. Wait, oh, this is our friend Snake, right? I was like, how did the cobra get inside? Usually wild animals, they can't do that. Yeah, that's Sam. Alright, you are restricted to the home area. Are you being trained? You are. I don't know if we have anyone who's really working with handling them. Val, oh boy. 
I heard it. I heard it before I... Hawk has gone berserk. I want everybody to come attack him. Labrador Retrievers join. Alright. Sweet. Where are they? Oh, really? We got two. Sapphire and Yaroslav. Alright, well you guys are going to stay in the home area. And you guys are going to get fully trained. So, make your way up there. It's going to be a long walk for you. Okay, Biko, you're gonna rescue Scorpion. Val. Okay, good. You're gonna rescue Hawk. So I'm actually gonna undraft, which probably means that they're no longer doing what I told them to. So like... Alright, good. We're gonna rescue Sam as well, don't worry. Biko. Rescue Sam. Biko's in a poor mood. Well, once you're done rescuing Sam, you can go do as you like. Scorpion, you need to be in bed. We need to do something about Hawk. Scorpion is also in a terrible mood. That's not good. Biko, please. Feed him. Feed him. Come back here. Bring him a food. It will be fine. Do not worry. Come on. I'm trying to see if. Alright. So, other than that, they seem to be. Wait, did I just get an extreme exhaustion note? Oh, so. Do we have... No, we just have some of this. We're gonna need more animal sleeping spots. We can make some more... Oh, we have all that sandstone. We can do a couple of sandstone sleeping boxes. We might as well use it, right? Do we have anybody doing research? Yes. Oh, God. Reason naked. Alright, I am so sick of Hawk right now. What does he even do for us? Oh, a lot of things. He's our cook, mainly. I knew I shouldn't have picked people who would break easily. It makes the beginning very, very difficult. He's trying to kill poor Yaroslav. Alright, Val, I want you to rescue Yaroslav. We'll undraft you. But you still have to rescue him. I should just kill you, you know that, Hawk. You've been nothing but a pain. We don't need you. Please save him. He is hurt. Yeah. 
Wait, who is not come? Okay, there you go. I was like, are you not coming to save him? Can we, like, lock this door so he cannot get out? We, you used to be able to arrest people that weren't going crazy like that. But now you can't, and I don't understand why... I mean, we could restrict him, but if he goes crazy, that wouldn't, that wouldn't do anything. So, you know, putting him in an area and restricting him to that area wouldn't actually help, unfortunately. I wish it would. I wish there was something we could do, because this, this is not working well. It's not working out. Oh, we got cargo pods. Ooh. So there's food out here. Alright, Biko's in a daze. I'm fine with that. As long as he doesn't die from his injuries because of it. And at least while Hawk is sleeping, he can't go crazy. Hawk has gotten sick. I don't even know if we have medicine. It doesn't look like we do. But yeah, no, I am sick and tired of Hawk going crazy at every, like, chance he gets. It's not fun anymore. Oh god. What did I just say? Oh my god, it's dark, so you went crazy. Good job, Pig. You did good. I guess we need to put in a, uh, a torch. Y'all are crazy. Yeah, it's like I told somebody to go rescue him. Not that I believe he deserves rescuing, but... Because he's driving me crazy. Like, I think at least two of the five episodes I've already made have Hawk's name in the title being like, He's gone crazy. What are you doing? This guy is ruining everything. Pretty much. Pretty sure that that's how it went down. And it's... it's Oh, boy. Alright, Val is relaxing socially by himself. What are you... An emu. No handle or contain an emu. Alright. Oh, God, no. God, don't do anything to the emu. Cancel that. So we do have a handler, Val, who's a handle of six. I'm gonna put handling up on his list of things to do. I think that would be good. Oh my god. Reason too hot. Okay, Scorpion, are you? Yeah, it's just gotten to the point where we're like, we're just gonna. There, now you're not in darkness. Get back in your bed. I don't care, Hawk. You are staying in bed. Can we, like, restrain him to the bed? Until things are just better here and he can stop complaining. Biko's exhausted. Well, Biko's wandering around aimlessly and I cannot make him go to sleep. So I don't know what you want me to do. 
I feel like they've made the beginning harder. It could be a tribe thing. And I know I, I had some people I picked. I was like, it'll be fine. They break easier. And now I'm not happy with that decision at all. But I still feel like it's been made a little bit more difficult. Yeah, see, now Biko is actually being a normal person, but Biko's going to get attacked when Hawk wakes up. That's cool, I know you could clear prioritize work like I told him. Who's severely ill? Hawk. Uh, an extreme infection. He might die from that. Because I don't even know if we have medicine. I guess we can try treating him. It looks like we don't have medicine. He did not bring medicine. What has happened? Something was fighting. It was an animal. Pants! I don't know why they're just pants here. Ooh. These are Biko's clothes, I can tell because they look so different. Alright, well, he might make it. Nope, he didn't. Oh no. <laughs> I can't believe he didn't make it. What will we do without Hawk? Scorpion, go get food. She's so hungry. Oh, he's going for the meals, isn't he? Alright, we lost our cook. That's not good. Two. One. Two. Okay. Well, I'm gonna give it to Scorpion. Who's our constructor? It's also Scorpion. Scorpion, busy man. Who's starving? Val. I mean, we have potatoes, I think. Yeah, we have plenty of potatoes. Oh, and we could butcher up this guy. So, who did I put as cook? Val. Scorpion. 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 Prioritize butchering. Alright, cargo pods. Ooh, we got artillery shells we won't use for a while. Oh, the fact that he is in here, I do not like. I hope he wanders back out. And then... Who's in charge of construction? Again, I just looked this up. Also, Scorpion. What are you doing? You're butchering. That's kind of important. Because I don't want the food to go to waste. Alright, now you're going to go rest. Well, I agree that rest is important. I'd like you to work on this grave. And then I'd like for you one more thing. Bury him. Well, we got what we needed, I think, honestly, is because I don't think we were going to get anywhere with him going berserk every few minutes. Like, it, it wasn't going to work out that way. Um, but this also means that we have a... Oh my goodness, Scorpion's sad. It also means that we have, you know, fewer people. But I'm afraid that's going to have to do. And for now, I think that's going to do it for this episode of RimWorld. So if you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Pegasus, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye! <laughs>